Y'all already know, I won't even lie to y'all, I found the f***ing belt. I found, I found the heat, I got the pressure, I got the sauce, I got the za. If you clicked on this video, you clicked on the right video. Ladies and gentlemen, gentlemen and ladies, I go by the name Provoke. I am the motion king. From getting all the females in the world and finding all the best builds, you clicked on the right channel, my brother. NBA2K23 is officially here, and this shit is looking amazing, baby! Y'all really know, straight up, automatically, whenever I see a new game, I start talking shit about it. I'm a very honest, what the f*** is this? Why was not it? Why is poor boys in there? Why is Provoke not there? I forgot I got no face. I'm a catfish. In today's video, I am bringing you guys the best point guard build. Now, straight up, I just wanted to say NBA 2K23 build system is completely crazy. Like, you have to pay attention to the attributes that you're making or else you're just gonna go downhill. Just moving the bar slightly can literally decrease any other bar. It's just so weird. It's, uh, it's literally, it's like you gotta, it's like making a fucking four. It's a, it's a math equation and I fucking hate math. But as your savior, I'm gonna show you guys how to make it from scratch. You gotta start off with the name, of course. Uh, my name is PP, if you guys don't know. <laughs> Let me change the first name. And that's more like it. You wanna go with the point guard position. Now, first thing first, this build is a point guard. So if you clicked on this video hoping for a taller build, unfortunately, I don't know what to fucking tell you. Left hand, because that's what I choke my chicken with. Number 69. Don't ask why. If you know, then you know. God, I'm ugly as shit. Just standing like a statue. And the camera on the top right is just staring at my booty cheeks. Hey, yo. Now, you want to go with 6'3", and you want to make sure the weight is at the lowest possible. You need this build at the fastest it can possibly be. Now, the wingspan is completely up to you, but specifically for me, I went with, um... Now, look, I'm not gonna lie. I tried to do it step by step for you guys, but it's physically impossible because once you mess up a little bit, it messes up the whole chart. I ain't want to be here all day. But I pretty much got the preset for you right now. If you like to ISO and you like to dunk and like to shoot... And and still be able to potentially hold defense this build is for you as an iso player you need quick first step on hall of fame if you do not if you're iso and you do not have that hall of fame the build is doodle it needs to go away because like what's what's the point you're about to be walking in slow motion gold is acceptable too but you know hall of fame because like why not you know you're a point guard you need that shit. you're supposed to be zooming now on the court you get contact dunks and you unlock badges that help you dunk now this system this badge point system is completely different from any other year a hall of fame badge is not worth four points anymore is actually worth more depending on the tier it's in so tier three a hall of fame badge in tier three could be worth seven points while in tier two it could be worth four or five and tier one it could be worth three hopefully i don't know maybe and like a silver badge and tier three is like five fucking points all the shooter badges like i said is everything is there everything is pretty much there you get all of the um, three point badges that you need now listen everyone that has their own build not any build is wrong every build is different you want to go with your own specific play style these build systems is made to destroy us it's like the um emancipation kind of occupation because like it's always trying to um 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 sex 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 and at the same time, the defense, you're, you're a point guard, your defense is not going to be A1, you're a point guard for a f***ing reason, but you still have some defensive badges that are needed to help you play some type of defense. Chase down artists, everybody needs that. Rebound chaser, you never know. Post lockdown on brawl, just in case someone tries to throw it back. But as a point guard, you don't really need to focus too much on tier three, because like, why do you need clamps on a point guard on a threes court? You should have your two guard and the point guard, because like, yeah, you know, common sense. But like, if you need it, go for it. Tier 2, you have Pick Dodger, which is extreme. You, everyone knows you need that. Shit. Everyone like side behind screens like little wussies. I'm talking about myself. Once you got this layout, you want to press continue. Just pause wherever you need to be paused. This build is not called Max Potential. It's actually called The Bitches. You want to press continue and let me go over the takeovers and everything. Now, what makes this build different is that um you unlock pretty much whatever you lack. So if you feel like the build lacks defense, you want to um pop the defensive takeover. If you want to be a super fucking playmaker, pop the playmaking sh want to shoot threes i mean you got a good three-pointer and a midi in her you, you know what i'm saying now even the slash and takeovers is all here everything is needed for you to go crazy in the park yeah i know yeah, i really know what i like to do i like to run run all day this is what i'm pretty much going this is what i'm pretty much going with yeah 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 sorry about that i had spit in my mouth it stinks now the build that i have created for you guys today i'm not sure why i'm not specifically on the build board but i should be on the billboard but i'm not complaining no it's all good i need my 2k contract my mob play is ugly as God, then everybody hates Chris. But you have built a three-point shot creator. As you can see, this build is pretty much a three-point shot creator because 2K said it's a three-point shot creator. This is how it looks at 99. You can speed boost, you can shoot, you get contact dunks, and most importantly, you can play defense. You're a 6'3 ice wing. Demigod. You're fast as fuck. 
and you could jump. Now, as I was saying about the batch point system, it's a completely different than any other year of 2K. You need to use 10 badge points in either tier one or tier two to unlock tier three. So you can't just slap on all tier three. I'm telling y'all, 2K is not playing this year. Like there's no wrong or right build. Now, once you get here, what's gonna make this build extremely deadly is the fact that everyone's build, not everyone can unlock two badges because not everyone has enough points to get two Hall of Fame or actually important badges. 2K tried to make it where you can't get limitless takeoff and posterizer immediately so people can't be busting ass immediately. But with this build and the way 2K is set up, I found a way around it. Now, once you have this badge layout, you have no more, so which means you can't get limitless takeoff. But once you play 2K and you get in the game, you get level 40, you unlock one badge point. And then when you meet Ronnie, he gives you four more badge points. And then boom! And then you can get the other two and you got a demigod over time this is gonna be the best build in the game you see what i'm saying like you gotta see you gotta understand just imagine the gold takeoff and the gold posterizer my brother yeah a demigod already and this is why i said specifically i have the best build in 2k because the same rule that applies with finishing applies to every other badge system in this game or every other badge category in this game if you feel like you lack shooting you don't have to use your four points on the finishing if you feel like the finishing is fine you can use it on the shoot in, and then you could get two gold badges or two silver badges in the tier threes you know what i'm saying it's, it's completely up to you same with the playmaking same with the defensive this is the safe build this is the bitches now let's get to the gameplay i'm gonna show you guys a little bit of action of me i actually did get to understand this game a little bit i have been practicing in the black top i 100 do love how smooth 2k is with this it's not a bad game at all my teammates is holding defense never fucking mind i'm playing with ai so i can't get really mad at them but you guys don't really know me I complain at everything now off rip I take the screen and I go straight in the paint as look look I'm a point guard and I just run straight to the paint I'm fast as f the dribbling system is completely different this year so once you use your stamina bars it's like yo bro you're like you're moving like a robot and then like that's where your actual stamina and your your speed is gonna have to take action now if you made a really tall build it's gonna be hard for you to do a lot because like you know you're tall as you know you're big as fuck but me on the other hand as you can see look at me i don't have all my badges well i do have my badges on if i had a better dunk package i would have probably yanked that shit but like yeah you, you see what i'm saying I'm, I'm pretty much zooming down the court and i'm doing everything I can't win. I pull up with that three point. Of course, I break that. Sh this jump shot slower than my grandmother, but it's easy to get open. I pull up with a fade three. I mean, a mid range, but I break it. You know, um, I didn't equip the badges. I forgot to equip it. I just hopped into the game because I I didn't want to be here all day. But like, yeah, everything is is is, is dead. It's dead. I'm playing dog shit right now. I don't got no six, so you can't really judge me and call me doodle. But like, I'm I'm doing my best. I'm pretty much going in and pain like everyone is a baby to me. The badges is there. Everything is needed for you to do everything you want. It's completely up to how you play. Like I said, if you're a shooter, you cannot have to dunk every single time like what I do. I'm holding perfect defense, as you can see. Look. All right, that, 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 that had to be some sort of racism because there's no way as soon as I talk, that sh happens. But the build is extremely explosive and you can pretty much get some doms in and you can pretty much play make and you can pretty much shoot and you can pretty much dunk and you can pretty much, yeah, yeah, that's what I'm trying to say. I got the one. But I'm not going to lie. I'm not going to sit here and watch the AIs just politely bust my ass in front of my channel i'm not gonna boy out of death um <laughs> part coming real soon y'all really know the part content goes crazy i just want to show y'all the build that i was starting off with and like yeah if you guys want to make this build it's completely up to you it's your boy provoke and i'm using the best build in 2k history Two, three pointer for your mother it don't matter if i miss that just know i'm still the greatest 2k player in 2k history until next time it's your boy signing off don't mind me even though i'm dog shit right now I, got, I gotta end off with a bang what the f was that? I'm out of this bitch. Until next time, peace.